I had a little cradle, I made it out of clay, and when it's dry and ready, old cradle I shall play, old cradle, 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 I made it out of clay, and when it's dry and ready, old cradle I shall play. Hi boys and girls and happy Hanukkah. Tonight I'm wearing my dreidel sweater because tonight is the sixth night of Hanukkah. Tonight we lit six candles. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six candles for the sixth night of Hanukkah. And tonight I have a very special story for you. It's a story about a little boy by the name of Abuya. Abuya lived in a land that was once called Persia, and Persian Jews had a very special tradition. Instead of receiving gifts during Hanukkah, the Jews of Persia would go door to door, knocking on the doors, a little bit like how you celebrate Halloween. And in, uh, during Hanukkah, the Jews would knock on the doors and wish each other Happy Hanukkah! And the people who were in the homes would give the children little candies or nuts or cakes or little gifts. These were the times of Abuya and Abuya's brothers and sisters. You see, Abuya had seven brothers and sisters. He was the eighth child, almost like the eight candles. One, two, three four, five, six, seven, eight. And each night, Abuya and his brothers and sisters would take turns lighting the candles. This was the eighth night of Hanukkah, and this was the night that Abuya had been waiting for. This was his turn to light the Hanukkiah. But Abuya was a little bit of a daydreamer, and as his brothers and sisters were singing Hanukkah songs before they lit the candles, Abuya drifted off into a dream, and he believed, was dreaming about Judah Maccabee and the great miracles that Judah and his brothers had brought to the world, when suddenly he opened his eyes and realized that all of his brothers and sisters were gone. They had left to go house to house to knock on the doors and wish happy Hanukkah. There was Abuya. He had his candles to light but nobody there to light them with. He was all by himself, and he sadly went out on his own to knock on the doors of his neighbors to wish them Happy Hanukkah. As Abuya entered the cold, cold winter night and marched off to the first house, he saw an old man sitting in the street under a tree, shivering away. And Abuya said, Hello, sir. Happy Hanukkah. And the man only looked up, and he was so cold. And Abuya thought to himself, all I have is my sweater. Maybe I'll give him my sweater to keep him warm. So he gave the man his sweater and went to the first house and knocked on the door. The door opened, and Abuya said, Happy Hanukkah! And the people said, Happy Hanukkah, Abuya. And they gave him a small bag of nuts. As Abuya left the house, he was walking down the street and he saw the man shivering under a tree with his sweater on. Abuya thought, you know what? This poor man, he needs these nuts much more than I do. And I have plenty of houses to go to. So Abuya gave the man his nuts, and the man looked up and said, Thank you. Abuya then went to the next house and knocked on the door. They opened the door. Abuya said, Happy Hanukkah! And they said, Happy Hanukkah, Abuya! And they gave him a wonderful cake. Abuya looked at the cake, and he thought to himself, I know who needs this cake far more than I do. And he brought the old man his cake. The man shivering took the cake and said, thank you. 
And Abuya went to the next house. And he decided at that moment that every gift he received, he was going to give to this man. And so he went to the next house and he knocked. He opened, they opened the door. Abuya said, Happy Hanukkah! And they said, Happy Hanukkah, Abuya. And they gave him a gay bag of candy. And Abuya went to the man and gave him the candy. He went to the next house. He went, knock, 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 knock. He said, Happy Hanukkah. And they said, Happy Hanukkah, Abuya. And they gave him a wonderful bag of little treats, little pretzels and crunchy things. And he said, the man needs these more than I do. And he brought them to the man and back and forth. Knock, knock, knock. Happy Hanukkah! And the booyah would bring everything to the man. Until the last house he knocked at. Happy Hanukkah! He said. They said, Happy Hanukkah, Abuya. And they gave him a wonderful challah. And he went to bring the challah to his friend, the old man. But the man was gone. So Abuya returned to his house with an empty sack and a challah. And he sat down on the floor with his brothers and sisters who were sitting around in a circle looking at their cookies and their cakes and their candies and their cakes and their candies and their cakes and their candies and all the sweet nuts and treats that they got. But a booyah, a booyah just had a challah. And that's it. And he thought about the old man and he thought, that man needed this much more than I, when suddenly they all heard a knock at the door. They went to the door and opened it up, and there was a man standing there. And that man had a sack, and the sack had candy and cookies and cakes and nuts. He gave him back to Abuya. And inside that sack were some very special coins as well. And at that moment, Abuya and his brothers and sisters knew that this was not any ordinary man, but this was none other than Elijah the prophet, who would bring goodness and peace and comfort to the world one day. And this was a very special Hanukkah indeed, as Abuya and his brothers and sisters celebrated something far more than the receiving of gifts. They celebrated the idea that it is far, far better to give than it is to receive. Boys and girls, for the last six nights, you've been receiving wonderful gifts to help celebrate this special festival. For the next two nights, I invite you to think about how good it feels to give. Be like a booyah. Give from your heart. Find someone or something in need and make them feel better with the special gifts that you can bring. We're going to end with one last special song for your Hanukkah tonight as we sing. <laughs> Six candles burning, six candles burning, six candles burning this sweet night. On our Hanukkah, on our Hanukkah, this sixth Hanukkah night. On our Hanukkah, on our Hanukkah, this sixth candle night. Happy Hanukkah. May it be a wonderful last two nights as you celebrate tomorrow, day seven, and the next day, day eight. Happy Hanukkah!